Hi Eurostar, my name is Declan O'Riordan and uh, this is my video for a talk on information assurance. So I'm going to tell you a short story. Back in October 2007, the UK Revenue and Customs Department had an organisational culture of muddling through. When another government department asked for a copy of the data relating to the child benefit payments, no one queried the legal basis for sharing the data or clarified how many records were really needed. No one redacted any of the personally identifiable information and no one properly understood secure encryption or secure data transfer. And so it was, two compact disks containing a full copy of the entire child benefit database for 25 million people was put in the unrecorded post and never seen again. Names, addresses, dates of birth, national insurance numbers, bank details, the lot. This was a gold mine for fraudsters if they ever got hold of those CDs. Members of Parliament gasped when the size of the data breach was revealed by the Chancellor of the Exchequer, whose job then hung by a thread amid calls for his resignation. His political party was accused of incompetence and has actually lost every general election since. The Metropolitan Police conducted a multi-million pound investigation and searched in vain for the disks. The general public lost faith in the government's ability to safeguard their data and a proposed UK identity card system was torpedoed by data handling scepticism. This event, accompanied by a series of other data losses, led to a revolution in information risk management and information assurance. Now, if you hear my talk at 10 a.m. on Thursday the 9th of June, I'll explain how a tester working in the EU, EU can become the head of information assurance for government digital services within the UK Cabinet Office. I can tell you that because that's my story and it's true. So uh, I hope to see you there. In the meantime, all the best. Bye from me.